Hatch, selecting objects. So let's go up and choose the hatch command. And instead of picking points, many times you might have way too many internal points to pick to get all the hatching you want. And so we have another option, which is come over here and say select. So we select the boundary objects. I'm going to come down here and pick on this rectangle. And now I'll come over here and close this editor. I get one hatch all the way through here now. And so sometimes it's just easier to pick a polyline, a circle, a group of connected objects, etc., to get what you want instead of picking all kinds of internal places. Second of all, um, I can come down here and go to hatch and I can choose select. And if I select this rectangle, you can see I get hatch running through the word, the text, and through the other object. So if I pick on this object, it will then not put text through there, it will exclude it. And I can also exclude it from going through the actual text, the single line text. So I can hit enter and now in this particular case my select boundary objects excluded this uh, polygon and this uh, lettering, this single line text from my hatch pattern.